Hello, this is the Nano Open Course, Collaborative Learning and Research Methodologies, organized by Ina Teach, the Erasmus Plus project led by UNID, Spain, and working in collaboration with Italy, France, Spain, Portugal and Bulgaria. During this course you will be introduced to collaborative learning and research methodologies and to some useful digital tools and activities that can improve your course and your students' participation. To improve your digital skills and the use of different teaching methodologies response to the new generation's need to be multiliterate, in other words, the need to be able to use different forms of digital information. In fact, we live in a multimodal world receiving information through videos, audios, texts, animations, games, or a combination of all these forms. Students need therefore to be trained in collaboration and to gain digital literacy. Some of these digital skills are already well known and include the programs we use, such as Word and Excel, practical skills, such as knowing how to read URLs, and critical skills, such as understanding domain names and eventually evaluating the quality of websites. But when it comes to advanced web searching, web design, blogging, publishing, making a movie and podcasting the situation changes dramatically. The pandemic emergency has shown that the introduction of digital tools in learning processes is often felt as a problem, mainly because the digital environment puts a physical distance between teachers and students and makes the digital divide more evident. Although modern students are digital natives, many educators are still digital immigrants. This means that adults and trainers are often reluctant to embrace technology in their courses. We offer here a course for teachers and trainers introducing them to different technologies which can support the learning processes and improve collaboration among students. We propose here to reflect on a possible change from the traditional model of vertical education, where the teacher transmits knowledge to the students in a one-way mode, to a horizontal and constructivist idea of learning through collaboration, where the use of digital tools can improve the sharing of information and the distribution of tasks within a network-like collaborative system. Collaboration-based instructional approaches promote active and agentic learning and collaborative research supports socially coordinated inquiries, knowledge creation, and stimulates a higher level of critical thinking. Our claim is, good teamwork and learning are not just based on sharing a physical space, they involve many other skills, tools, competences, and attitudes that have to be integrated, reflected and worked on. This online course is structured in five units. Each unit is divided into two topics and provides a total of 25 hours of work. Each of the four topics is organized in micro lessons followed by exercises, activities, and other resources. The five topics will focus on Introduction to the course Collaborative learning, with some basic ideas about this learning methodology distributed cognition and computer-supported collaborative learning, as pillars of the collaborative environment, digital environments and designing for online, evaluation and research. Aims of the course are to engage your interest about collaborative learning and research methodologies, to invite you to reflect about the concept of distributed cognition and learning networks, to guide you through some digital experimentation with different digital tools. To reflect upon digital tools to be used in the evaluation process. Each topic will start with a short video introducing some basic ideas and information. After carefully watching the video you are invited to read the instructor's comments. In this section you will find more materials and exercises to be followed in order to deepen your knowledge about the topic and to have some practical advice or examples. After following the instructor's comments you will be invited to go to forum activity and share your insights and comments on the forum. This is a very important task which will give you the possibility to have feedback and get in contact with other teachers and trainers' experiences. At the bottom of the unit's page you will find the section supplementary materials with many more useful documents, articles, presentations, and the transcripts as attachments. Before going to the next topic you are invited to go to do activity and complete the unit. 
you are free to follow the units or jump back and forth developing your own pace and following your personal interests. What should you do? All we will ask you is to watch, read, participate in tasks, reflect, but above all to share your insights or doubts within the forum. We believe in communities discussing and sharing knowledge and are looking forward to your feedback. So, please also register in our University Teachers Network through the form, a link WC6F2X. The course is designed for university and school teachers but it is open to everyone. We hope you will not only learn about methodologies and digital tools but also get stimulated in projecting your future courses and enjoy the learning process.